Alright. Been a while since we played this game, huh? Um, that's it. Now I just need to figure out what the heck I was doing. <laughs> Let's live across the bridge ahead. There he is, crammed full of awesome palaces. <clears throat> One of them belongs to Queen Himiko, ruler of Nippon. You can tell because it's really huge. No idea what she's like, but I'm not sure I'll like her. I mean, she doesn't seem to be doing anything about this mist. Plus, I make it a point to never trust queens like anyway. Is that what I'm supposed to do? This is like the only journal entry we have, why? supposed to visit the queen. <laughs> That's all I can think. I guess it can't hurt to go over there. What are you doing? Yeah, we still got a water dragon to deal with. I got on the wrong side of the water dragon last time, unfortunately. I'm starting to think that maybe I was grinding demon things last time I was here. I'm not sure what for though. Or maybe I was trying to get the guys on the wanted list. I don't know if that's really what I want to do right now. I just want to progress. Hey, Audrey. Have you played this game, Audrey? Because I really don't know what I'm doing right now. weird that you have to enter a, a temple or whatever just to get to the other side of this town. you have anything important to say? All of what you've done so far is amazing. However, the water dragon is a much bigger problem. No trading ships can go through the city. The city's food is really low. The evil besieging our fair land still looms large in the shadows. Now is exactly the time we need them. If only we had the fox rods. Oh right, we were looking for fox rods. But where are we gonna get fox rods? Hey, what's up, NP sir? I don't even know how to pronounce that correctly, out loud. <laughs> You're persistent one, aren't you, man? For whatever reason, the curse seems to be dissipated. There's still a sinister presence in Yoshima Coast, though. So we won't let it let it lay a finger on Queen Himiko. No, we guards won't let any evil get the better of us. Yes, it's mostly that part that is unsure to pronounce. Sao? Soa? <laughs> Seo? <laughs> bah, Himiko's people all sound like a bunch of parrots. Maybe they can stand up to the evil of those monsters. But I bet there's no match for the brush technique of the gods. What? What if- so you're telling me to cut them? Is that it? Oh, 
brush technique of the gods. What brush te techniques do I have? It's been so long I can't even remember. Veil of Mist. I have way too many brush techniques. Gale Storm. I can blow him away. Nope. <laughs> Inferno. I need fire though to do that. Veil of Mist. Oh, it worked. <laughs> How did that work? Are they that stupid? Bury your treasure outside here, but I'll take it. Well, shoot. Looks like we've made some progress. Self opening doors, that's a bit creepy. those teleportation spots I think maybe not I thought it had a whirlpool in it but it was only showing because I was in there swimming I'm just gonna be so rusty with this game okay this door opens too what about the center where does center take me Not an intruder. I'm totally welcome here. Why, it really is you. Your Majesty Queen Himiko has foreseen your coming. You must us? If you're really the one that Queen Himiko has been looking for, even a boiling sea of flames won't stand in your way, will it? What? Boiling sea of flames? Why? Maybe I should check out those other rooms first. This looks like where the game wants me to go. Where does this go? treasure. Wow. Northern land? What is that about? Evil demons that flourish throughout the land, no matter how many are defeated, their numbers do not thin, and the burden they place on human hearts does not dissipate. These foul fiends come from a land far to the north of Nippon. From there, they infiltrate our land and perpetuate nefarious acts. The northern lands are feared as a breeding ground for evil. For many years, Nippon has severed itself from the land to the north. An unclean land where evil runs wild without restraint, however, it is also said that all of the creation originated in the north. Hmm, don't say. I get the feeling we're gonna go north soon. It's 
nice coming back to this game, actually. I've held off on it way too long. Hope you guys enjoy it. You probably will once I actually get into something that's <laughs> more action-y in the game rather than just bucking about. Alright. What do we have here? An elevator. Go towards the light. Holy artifacts. Throughout the land are spread power enhancing holy artifacts. These rare treasures grant one the great power when equipped. Up to three of these accessories can be equipped at any time. It is difficult to exaggerate the rarity of these precious items. Don't expect to stumble upon too many of them in your journey. Once you've obtained one, it will be a force for great stability. Forget not what you have read here. Okay. Whoa! What the heck? What's all this lava doing here? Maybe God now, but you'd end up crispy critter if you fell into that stuff. But we won't give up that easy. Did Himiko really think this could stop the great Amaterasu? Why don't you just equip that thing you got? That Himiko sure's making things difficult. She must really have a good reason for wanting to keep people away. Let's keep going, Amy, but be careful. How the heck does she get lava in her palace? On the top floor at that. What is this, Minecraft? What's that thing he was saying to equip? Oh, this one? What does it do? Can I just literally walk into the lava now? Protects from fire. Oh, it still hurts still hurts just not immediately I'm guessing I can't draw a lily pad on here no it's everything I do is gonna be fire It'll be slowly burning me okay cool well that was an easy challenge to beat I'm sure she's just shy. She's totally not trying to stop us from seeing her or anything. Big room. Hello? Hey, Amy. I bet that's Himiko. Looks like that freaky Shudden is praying or something. <laughs> the security here was pretty tight. But nothing we couldn't handle. Yeah, you tell her, Amy. Benevolent Amaterasu, I have a bit. I have been waiting for you. And Isu, the traveling artist. You too, of course. Hey, how'd you know our names? Anyway, first things first. You knew about that funky mist and the water dragon, didn't you? You got some explaining to do. Tell us what you're up to. 
She also has a fire on her head for some reason. Like, what's that about? <laughs> my people, my poor people, they're suffering torments me. Sickened by this mist and terrorized by the water dragon, the cries of their pain wash over me like a torrent. <laughs> We know what's going on. You're tormenting the people of this city. It must be a monster feeding off the ill will it generates. Now stop stalling and raise this grimy old curtain. Come on, show yourself, you old hag. Your words are very harsh. But you are right. It was rude of me to hide my face from you. Benevolent Amaterasu, I, Himiko, the ruler of Saiyan City, offer my most sincere apologies. Queen of Saiyan City, Himiko. Oh my gosh. After you called her an old hag too, you just drop dead like that. <laughs> As ruler, I can't stand by and watch my people suffer. I, Himiko, will not allow this evil to darken sand. My prayers will not cease until we are rid of this curse. Until I've located the hateful monster's stronghold. Oni Island. You okay, man? What's this about a monster stronghold? Are you saying that's the source of your city's problems? Can't say I've ever heard of Oni Island or whatever you call it. What do you mean you're trying to locate the island? I mean, it's an island, right? Couldn't have just floated away. Oni Island is elusive. It vanished each day at sundown, shifting to a new location. No one knows where in the vast white ocean it will reappear. So even if I wanted to dispatch an army there, it would never arrive. You don't say. Still, I just stay cooped up in this room all day long. I mean, what good will it do to simply pray in day and out? She's trying to mess with us. It's the treasure, crystal ball. Oh, treasured crystal ball. My family, the Yama Tai clan, has ruled Saiyan City forever. This crystal ball has been passed down through the generations. I can foresee the future in it. It told me you were coming, and it will tell me where the Ocean Oni Island will appear next. Interesting. I could find Oni Island in a jiffy with that thing. Exposing a stronghold like Oni Island demands much holy power. But if our enemies knew about my prayers, they would stop at nothing to prevent me in my mission. That is why I have locked myself away, praying at prayers are my only hope. But the spearhead of the enemy's forces may already be on its way. <laughs> That's a pretty good story, Queenie. But I'll go along with it. I mean, what's what the heck? I'd do anything for a pretty lady. Heh. <laughs> oh my gosh, there he goes. <laughs> Ouch, thanks for the warning. 
Careful, you cannot approach me now. By taking this crystal ball in my hand, a powerful magical barrier is erected to dispel any misfortune. You will be struck down by divine forces if you try to approach. This crystal ball ensures my safety. Even if my enemies learn of my prayers, the barrier will protect me from their attacks. Okay. So you're gonna tell me where Oni Island is or what? Hello? I'm a Tratsu. I entreat you once again. Will you hear my request, the request of all my people? Yeah, sure. The mighty water dragon now threatens the peace of the oceans. I don't know why it has suddenly turned to savagery. The water dragon is a sea god whose task is to maintain order. So though it may cause harm, we invite chaos if we try to slay it. In fact, without the water dragon, Oni Island is beyond our reach. What the heck's that supposed to mean? Quit beating around the bush and just spit it out already. The key to reaching Oni Island lies in the water dragon. Even if the crystal ball shows me the location of the island, the island's powerful shield will prevent us from reaching it. Any attempt to break the shield will only result in our own pain. But the water dragon could break the shield with ease. It could form a bridge over the sea to the island. So you're saying that you, you reveal the location of Oni Island, and the water dragon will break the barrier around it? Is that the only way to get into the enemy's stronghold? But what about the water dragon? It's out of control, right? I seriously doubt it'll be happy to help us. That is why I must ask for your help, Amaterasu. Your powers could calm the water dragon and get it to help us. I cannot leave this place, for my prayer requires all my energy. You are the only one who can take this important task. You gotta be kidding me. You want us to make friends with the rampaging water dragon? Well, I'd do anything for a cute babe, but... If my boss here says no, there ain't not much I can do. Oh, boss? What? We gonna help Himiko or what? Yeah? Bummer. Well, the boss has spoken. Huh? What was that, Amy? Oh, I'm a Tratsu. You're truly benevolent. So I entrust you with this boulder key. Use this key to cross the border and continue into the land beyond. Okay, cool. Progress. It is said there is a race which controls the water dragon. They live in the sea beyond the border in the Dragonian Domain. They may have been connected to the dragon's recent behavior. Please calm the water dragon and open the path to Oni Island. Cool. Progress, guys. Now look at the mess you've gotten us into, Furball. Well, at least we know who's been controlling that water dragon. Let's go pay the Dragonian Domain a visit. Right. Still can't believe she keeps lava in her top floor. So are these guys gonna care if I just walk out now? 
Hey, how'd you get in here, mutt? This is terrible. How did you get past our foolproof defense? How could you let Queen Ian go down like this? Ugh, get out of here, mutt. Oops. Oh, I guess their defense is back up. Boulder key. Where am I gonna use the boulder key? I guess I just need to leave. way maybe oh, yeah. oh yeah. hey that's a border key a permit from Emiko oh, for oh, crossing oh, the border yeah. what on earth are you doing with something oh, like that yeah. oh, yeah. rules are rules anyone bearing it it's allowed to pass oh, you yeah. yeah. must be on some very important business I suppose oh, yeah. Yeah. I'll open the gate straight away. Cool. Thanks, bro. Time to save the world. Wow, that mountain looks angry. Now then, where's Do Dra Dragonian Dragonian Domain? It sounds like something that might be under the sea, but I'd rather not have to get wet if I could help it. It's not because I'm afraid of that pesky water dragon. It's just, you swim so slow that you practically put me to sleep. Thanks, man. Thanks, I really appreciate that. Oh, shoot. Bonjour, Amaterasu. <laughs> it's Taru. <laughs> Trust you enjoyed your little adventure through that hole. The city's air is sure cleaned up thanks to you. Just ignore him and maybe he'll go away. Come on, Amy. <clears throat> Why so grumpy today? Didn't you notice the view? It used to be one big curse zone out here. But yours truly pulled off one of those great divine interventions. What? I really wanted to wait for you to. But I couldn't stand leaving the sea in such a cursed state. Yeah, he appears out of nowhere like him. But I couldn't stand leaving the sea in such a cursed state. Ah, the sea of, off Ryoshima coast is back to its beautiful self. Is this what you they mean by prettier than a picture, my little friend? What's that supposed to mean, pretty boy? Oh, just a little something I overheard somewhere. So, my little bouncing friend, you're a wandering artist, no? I wanted to see how beautiful your paintings are. Just one would be fine, pretty please. Hmm? My art's none of your business. Why should I show you anything? You really are in a bad mood today. You're not one of those imposters who claim to be an artist, but could not paint a picture in his if his life depended on it, are you? What? Oh, nothing. It's just something some old man mentioned. His grandson, who was also his apprentice, ran away from home. And he took the old man's painting of a wood spirit with him. 
Do you think he might claim to have painted that masterpiece? I mean, there are so many unscrupulous people out there. Sometimes it is hard to spot an imposter in the wide world of art. But you wouldn't know anything about that, would you? I don't know what the heck you're talking about. Now make like a tree and leave. Or you can stick around if you'd rather get sliced and diced. You do not have to get all hot under the collar. It would appear I have struck a raw nerve. Well, since I have no prophecies or anything for you this time, I suppose I'll just be on my merry way. Au revoir, baby. Thanks. Well, who cares if the suit's just a liar and nobody? Wonderful. Gigantic nose on a wheel. What the heck? <laughs> if I do this, will it affect the nose? Does he like alcohol? How do I even... How do I even fight? I gotta remember how to fight. Yeah, I cut him in half. I'm doing something right. seems pretty beaten up. That's the button I was looking for. Okay. That's like it. And there's one of those blossom trees here. Oh, of course cats like fish. What am I thinking? Thank you. I don't think I can do anything with that statue yet. Thank goodness I can make lily pads appear out of nowhere. Wonder if I should fight these guys. I don't know. I just kind of explore first. You should see what that building is. What the heck? Ow. This isn't a very good weapon for flying enemies.
I can't even remember how you level up in this game. Oh yeah, it's with those points, that's right, I remember now. Never remember which button digs. I wonder how you get up there. I think my talisman makes it so he can't hurt me. Sheesh, thanks camera. <laughs> Umi's restaurant. Mmm, I just love the smell of seafood. Okay. Oh, welcome. They're cat people. We're happy to see anyone in here at the moment, even a dog. It's just isn't any fresh fish available these days. Hardly got any customers at all. Well, it probably doesn't help that the door to this area is locked up. We're well known for our chef, Mr. Umi, fresh fish dishes. I hope you'll get to try one of them. But you're all out. Can't get around you? Oh, I guess I can. Are you Mr. Umi? Goodness gracious, whatever will I do? Even I, the great chef Umi, can't cook without ingredients. I'm at the end of my rope. Cyclone Chef Umi. Listen, dog. Can I bend your furry little ear? There's no good fish here lately. I can't cut cook without fish. I feel like I'm starting to lose my touch. I've had enough. There's got to be something around here that'd be a good, make a good meal. Hey, what you looking at? Hmm. No, it just, it'd be too much effort getting all that fur off you. I need some juicy fruits of the sea or show what I, to show what I can do. That must be fresh. It's an old insult to the sea and the fish if the dish goes wrong. Now, I don't know what the story is about the water dragon, but I do know that the fish I need aren't being caught. Still, I've asked the fishermen. <clears throat> I can't do any more than that. I guess all I can do is sit tight and wait for good news. <sighs> okay. I guess I should look for the fishermen then, perhaps? 
You have fish. I mean, I guess they're not fresh, but there's fish right here, bro. Plenty of fish. Get to cooking. He's just a liar. Doesn't want to doesn't want to cook. I don't even know what animal I'm looking at. Oh, cat. These guys are being relentless right now. people over there. There's treasure chest down there. Nothing I can really do to get it though. I don't know how to swim. Hello, sir. Alright. Take care and be so... Mm -hmm. huh. That's a great idea. That would sell like hotcakes. A donut in the shape of Oni Island. The doy nut? <laughs> Doni nut? Will be great. Look, you can see Oni Island from here. This is the perfect spot to sell Oni Island merchandise. Gotta make the best of a bad deal, right? Or you'd wind up miserable. That demon-shaped island appears out of nowhere a while ago. When the water dragon went crazy, the city got that weird fog. All that's happened since that island turned up. And every day it looks like it's in a different place too. There can't be a weirder sight anywhere in the world. Only island, eh? But it's gonna be tough getting over there. And once we get there, I bet we wish we never did. What are you muttering about? It's time to liven up and do some business. Your shopping duty today, Pooch? Then take a look. Sure, what do you got? A marlin rod, a mermaid coin. Got some food. I guess I'll buy a couple meat and a couple fish. That's all I seem to buy from these guys. I guess I can buy the Marlin Rod, why not? It's so cheap. Or rather, I'm so rich. Nice, nice circle. Care to try again? Um. Sure, let's let's raise our ink. Even though part of me feels like health is more important than ink. Hey, it's a dog. Here, have some meat. I guess I should try talking to the fisherman over here.
you a fisherman? Look awfully young. Hey, Rashima. So you got taken by that orca guy, right? And he took you to the castle at the bottom of the sea? If that's the truth, where's that porca now, huh? Yeah, where is he now? Yeah, where is he? What are you talking about? It ain't porca, it's orca. He's an emissary of the dragon palace. And he only comes for people worthy of going there. Yeah, right. Didn't your mom teach you not to tell lies? Let's get him. Yeah! Get him! <laughs> hey, what do you think you're doing? Only cowards gang up on people like that. Hey, who's that? Good timing. I'm bored of playing with him now. Come on, let's go play somewhere else. Yeah! Let's go play! Wow. What do you think those little brats were talking about, Amy? What did they mean by a castle at the bottom of the sea? Uh, it's probably what we're looking for, Eason. Hey, kid. How long you plan on staying like that? Hey, I'm talking to you. What's wrong, kid? Hey, kid. Hello? Anyone home? Hello? Hello? <laughs> what are you gonna do? <laughs> Any bright ideas for a ball? Um... I don't know. Tackle? Hey. I must have dozed off. I reckon I do that a lot at the beach. Uh, you can have something sticking out of your uh, bucket, sir. I don't know who you all are, but I'm sure I appreciate your waking me up. When I ain't got the strength to go home, sometimes I nap here. You're sleeping? Bah, you really had us worried. Hunched over so long like that. You're not sick or injured, are you? No, sir. I'm fit as a fiddle, I am. Just taking a nap on the beach is all. Oh, well, that's a relief. Anyway. What was that about a castle at the bottom of the sea? Would you mind filling us in? No. No one ever believes me about that. It's land under the sea here in Ryushima. Dragonarians and the sea god live there in the Dragon Palace. The Dragon Palace is an amazing place, real pretty. I haven't been there in a dog's age though. Dragon Palace, land of Dragonians? They're the ones controlling the water dragon, Himiko said so. So just how does one get down to that place, Bucket Boy? How could a chubby, or a, I mean, big boned lad like you elude that water dragon and make it all the way down to the bottom of the sea? The water dragon was much nicer in those days. But you can't just choose to go to the dragon palace, see? Only worthy people can go. If you're worthy, an emissary called Orca can get you. So this orca dude is an emissary from the Dragon Palace. Just how do you get to meet this guy anyway? Now that's one question that ain't so easy to answer. Y'all see that pier over yonder? That pier's where I met Orca. I was looking out at, to the sea when he came with the morning sun. Orca only comes if you're worthy of the Dragon Palace, I reckon. Thanks, man. You have anything else to say before I check it out? Alright, alright. All right. Morning sun, worthy, blah blah blah. Okay, I get it.